What are the benefits of a global growth portfolio for retirement products for South African investors? Thank you, Andrew. I think the benefit of having a global growth portion of your portfolio, as per many of the videos you have on, uh, on Black Onyx, is that the South African investor typically over the last five to 10, and even potentially longer, has really struggled with uh, the returns we've seen in the South African market. If one looks at equity returns in particular over the last five to 10 years, there really is very low uh, returns that they would have seen out of the South African market. Now, the problem with that has been uh, the potential for inflation to have crept in. And when one looks back five to 10 years, it's a long time in retirement savings and sort of gearing for people who are really trying to save for the long term and to get a return that they can base their retirement lives on. If we look at something like a global growth return and why we feel this is important, although limited by Reg 28, we feel this puzzle piece has allowed for real growth and allows the South African investor you know, a growth portion of his portfolio, which diversifies him away from the South African environment, where he may also or she may also be employed with one of the companies um, that also, you know, compose a risk to their retirement. How well is their particular company doing? You know, how much are they able to save? So when it comes to the pure, pure investment portions of retirement portfolios, in my view, having a global growth portion is essential for a South African to make sure that your growth potential is there for your retirement over the time being, from the time being, sorry, right through to, to when the date of retirement is. So in, in any Reg 28 portfolio, I mean, the key purpose is really around retirement savings. And in essence, the more money you have, the more comfortable you can retire, or the more money you'll be able to leave to your dependents, your children, however wish you choose. So growth is the key aspect over the long term in that type of portfolio. Now, given that South Africa is such a small percentage of the global economy, uh, it would be foolish to have all your investments in one economic basket, if you like. Your properties here, your future income in terms of your salaries here, and a number of your investments are already here. So global growth adds a significant uh, diversification factor and allows you to get into industries where in South Africa you might not have such a, a level of exposure or have as many uh, options to, to those kinds of industries or sectors.